What is up, YouTube? It's your boy, DJ Slank Man. Today, I'm going to be showing you guys how you can get your videos to pop up in the search results easier, faster, and as a recommended channel or video. Alright, so first what you want to do is when you upload a video, you know, at the very bottom right here, I'll show you. When you upload a video, you have at the bottom the tag area, okay? This area right here is going to be one of your most important tools to getting your video found, okay? Okay, so your tags, that's how your video gets found. So say it's like a key phrase that someone types in and that you have that in your tag or a variation on your tag, it's going to pop up on your video. So like I have for this video, it's the uh, free beats, a young, a young Dolph TM88 and a black youngster type beat. So in one of the tags, you know, I have a Black Youngster type beat, I have also TM88 type beat, I have a Young Dolph type beat, and that's going to be able to make your video pop up, you know, out of all the other videos, because if your tags are strong and they're concise and they're specific, your video is going to pop up first. Um, <clears throat> you don't want to have, like, you, wanna, you don't want to just kind of throw up stupid tags and stuff like that. Say, like, you have a really serious video and you put up funny and someone types in the keywords funny and they come across your video and it's not funny they're gonna leave your page immediately all right and it's just yeah, you're not gonna get subscribers you're not gonna get views that way you also can only put about like 30 to 25 tags so like i said be specific be concise with your tags um any variation on what your video is about you know, make sure to fill those out. There is a helpful tool that I use, and it's called YouTube Tags. You type that in Google, and it's going to bring you up to this website. And pretty much, you type in the keyword that you want to tag, and it'll come up with all the variations that people are most clicking on it in the past day. So, that is a good tool to use, especially if you're kind of like running out of tags and you don't know what to fill in. Go up on YouTube Tags, and you'll be able to find them. Another thing. In your description area and the description area be sure to fill that out with a good description in the search results it also pulls the keywords from your description so make sure that whenever you fill the description out that it's about the video and use as many concise and you use as many keywords as possible now some people will go crazy and you'll see like pages where it says ignore and then there are all these words below it do not do that because that is abusing the metadata system and YouTube will ban your video to take all your views and you won't be able to upload anymore of that video. So don't do that. But you can include like 50 to 100, um, just nothing over that 100. Because you could put up to 5,000 words in your description. But like I said, if you abuse it, YouTube will find out to take a chance. They'll take your video off. I've had it done to me like 15 times. So yeah. Also, Right over here, where it says channel, whenever you are in your creator studio, go to channel and click on advanced. When you click on advanced, there will be an area up here that says channel keywords. In that area where it says channel keywords, you're gonna put keywords that specifically pertain to your YouTube channel. So, I'm a beat maker, I'm a DJ, I am a vlogger, I, I put out funny videos and stuff like that. So, in my channel keywords, I have how to make beats, um, free beats, you know, whatever your channel pertains to, go ahead and fill those keywords out because that will also get you a higher up SEO which is a research result. If you guys like this video, please hit a thumbs up, share the video with anybody that you know that is a YouTube creator, and as well, subscribe to my page if you have not. DJ Slankman out.